time where we step in and see what's going down. What's in the what's on the on the, on the menu in Big Guy's Kitchen? Why am I stuttering? What's going down in Big Guy's Kitchen today, man? Yesterday we had ourselves some uh, steam fish with, well, sorry, saute fish with uh, what was it? White rice and coleslaw, right? That's what it was. And I actually prepared it when I went home, and I had me a nice big snapper that I uh, was holding on to for a while, and I put it in the frying pan. Just like I said, some butter. Lots of onions, uh, some garlic, some bell peppers, and um, what else was it? Uh, uh, and uh, some. One more ingredient garlic. Yes, that's the other ingredient. Oh, tomato, by the way, as well. So, tomato, onion, garlic, bell pepper, butter. Low flame. Look here. Wow. Okay, that was good. I, I truly enjoyed that. That was good. No rice. That's it, because the fish was pretty big. It was a huge plate size uh, fish, so that's what I enjoyed. That's what happened in Big Guy's Kitchen yesterday. Anyhow, got a did you know to share with you. It has to do with pistachios, man. I don't know about you, but I love myself some pistachios. I kind of get carried away sometimes because um, you can't just eat a handful. Doctors always say your fist size is what you should eat, right? But when it comes to pistachios, come on, man. Let's be honest. You already spent like 10 bucks in change for the bag, so you know. You sit down, you snack in that salty snack, and you turn around the bag empty. You be like, oops, I was supposed to save something for later. But anyway, uh, due to chemical uh, reactions with uh, ripening pistachios, the cashew family nut has been known to occasionally spontaneously combust. That's right, randomly catch on fire. Don't worry, it won't happen in your cupboard. It happens during the uh, shipping process, only because it's... Uh, it occurs in large mass quantities. Yeah. So uh, no need to panic, but just wanted to share it with you. Coming up, you'll see what's on the menu in Big Guy's Kitchen today. And I got something special for you. The use of that cast iron skillet that you got from your Grammy, your mom, or your mother-in-law. Yeah. That's what we're going to use today with this dish. So you're going to need yourself some extra virgin olive oil. Uh, some lean turkey ground. Roll with that. Some garlic, minced garlic, some uh, onions as well, some uh, bell peppers, and of course your sweet potato. You get a nice sweet potato up and add some small cubes so it can cook quickly, uh, so, as well as some salt and black, black pepper, and uh, some red chili flakes, man, and most importantly, some shredded mozzarella. Yeah, that's what you're going to need for this dish. That's your recipe uh, ingredient, sorry, right there. Now, what you're doing is you're pulling out the skillet, like I said, olive oil, medium heat, Turkey ground, cook that. You know what to do with the turkey ground, man. Cook it until the pink is gone, till it's done. All right. Then you're gonna add the onions, the uh, yellow peppers, and everything else. Add all the other ingredients. Let that come together. Ha ha ha. Then, uh, then you're gonna come with the uh, sweet potato, man. Add the sweet potato to the dish as well. Yeah, that, that you cut up in cubes. Okay. And hopefully you have a really large uh, skillet. Depending on the size of your family you're cooking for. If it's just for two, hey, you get to go, man. No need to worry. Oh, um, now. Add a little water to the uh, dish so the sweet potato can cook a little faster. Cover the uh, the pan, the frying pan, the, the skillet, I should say. Cover that. And um, once the uh, sweet potato is to the texture that you like, hey, this is where you're going to slide it in the oven. 400 degrees in the oven. Sprinkle the uh, mozzarella over that. Slide it in the oven just enough to uh, melt your cheese, man. That's it. Take it out. That's your dish right there. Yes, a turkey ground sweet potato pot. Look here, one pot shot. If you want, you can throw a little tossed salad on the side of that just to balance it out. That's what's going down in Big Guy's Kitchen today, man. Take a crack at it. And um, if your family loves spaghetti, they're going to love this dish right here, man. Okay? And also, no rice. But, uh, sweet potatoes are good for you. Turkey ground, lean turkey ground is healthy for you. So you're in the right lane. You're good to go. That's what's happening in Big Guy's Kitchen today. Here's uh, Johnny Gill. And don't forget, man, today is uh, Love Your, well, National Spouse Day. So go ahead and give your spouse some love. Say, baby, I'm cooking tonight. <laughs>